Christian Dibble. 11, William Michael Linden. 12, Dan Jarvis. 17, Bryce Azana. 19, Jordan. Fifth place Wrexham against 17th place Aldershot Town. Referee Tom Kirk is going to get us underway. Just the one game in the National League this year, uh, Grimsby. And uh, two yellows, no reds, and straight away Mullin bursts forward with Wrexham playing in their home kit of uh, red and uh, red shirts with white sleeves, white shorts with red sleeves, and uh, white socks with red trim. Uh, tireless run in of Tommy Willard goes all the way back to Rob Lainton. Good ball from Lainton. Forward to uh, the right-hand side. Mullins trying to keep it in here. Uh, ball comes in. Cushion header at the far post from Jordan Davies. And he gets it all wrong. He cushions his header wide. He was right. Yeah, Mark, Mark's had it tough. He when you come in six weeks into the season, the previous manager signed all the players, probably spent a large amount of the budget, and you're trying to bring in extra players, you're just really going to get players that are... are Aldershot have got a little counter-attack here and Colin Daniels on, his left-hand side strokes it into the area and it's cleared away by Wrexham calmly by Toza into touch, throw into Aldershot, down by the corner flag away to our left and halfway stage in the first half without conceding and they have had a couple of little moments, haven't they, where Aldershot have uh, looked like they can win it and threaten on the edge of the... Uh, Wrexham area as Phillips heads into touch. It's just really about going as long as they possibly can into the game without conceding. Here's the cross in from the right, headed away by Reese Hall Johnson. Follow up shot comes in from the number 32 and it's tipped over the bar. It's a throw, throw it's another throw right. down, right down by the corner flag away to our left. Alfie Saunders is going to take it. Phillips is up there, so's Jordan, so's Silla. Looking for that vital first contact. And it, oh, it's missed the first attempt by players from both sides. And there was a moment where it was there. Had there been an order shot town play, he'd have had a tap in. Not managed Good to work. find a lead despite their early dominance. Something they're used to here. It's happened a lot this season. Willard with the corner to the far post and it's left by everybody and it'll go out of play. In fact, now an Aldershot Town player goes down, nothing given. Toza does keep it in, clears it only as far as Phillips. Phillips finds Saunders, puts a cross in and Paniatu stretching and then Willard stretching. Couldn't quite get there. Terrific looking ball from Alfie Saunders. Up the tempo and up the territory again. Uh, Although uh, they're just playing it at the moment, back from one side to the other. Jordan Davies has come quite deep. And uh, James Jones gives it to Hayden, who goes down the right wing. Paul Johnson plays a little ball in, looking for Mullin. And this time, Mullin strikes it first time across the keeper. And Wrexham have the goal. Wrexham won. Aldershot Town, nil. Glover up top. Corner, right footed, outswinger, headed across goal, chested down by Glover inside the area and then towed away. Only as far as McFadden. Jordan rises and heads first and strongest. It's headed on again by Willard. And then. Oh, Silla just literally hands on it quickly, free kick given. Shot comes in. Oh, brilliant goal! Another brilliant goal from Jordan Davis. Free kick taken quickly. And the volley he tried in the first half, this time comes off. It's a touch. Two Wrexham players offside for me, but nothing given. Wrexham take the throw short. And uh, McFadden does well, pulls it back. And Palmer side puts it into the goal. 3-0 Wrexham, and the route is on! Silla's still on the pitch, so is Vennings, so is Daniel. Alfie Saunders has gone off. And I'm not sure if Aldershot changed their shape as well, let's keep a little eye on that as we go forward. So Jaden Harris is on. 
Uh, here's Vennings, twisting and turning away from trouble. Oh, and then he slips and he's given it away. And Mullin might shoot here, he does. Oh. And I'm so sorry, listeners, but I can only call as I see it. Two catastrophic errors by Aldershot. Wrexham. Aldershot have possession from their own throw. Oxley Chamberlain exchanging passes with Jaden Harris. Lovely ball out to the left hand side to find Tommy Willard. It could go one and one up against Tozan. It cuts in seat, tries to get a shot away. Gets a lot of power on it. Flies up in the air as he bounces off the player. The ball comes loose to Vennings. Vennings shoots. That's deflected behind. It's caught by the keeper, but behind the line. It'll be a corner to shots. We'll give a balanced view. We'll give it as we see it. Oxlade Chamberlain with the throw into the area, headed away by Hayden, back to Oxlade Chamberlain, chips the ball up to the far post. And uh, Glover got up well, and I think he managed to get a header on target. It was And uh, Sam Matthews, one arm in the air, will take the corner into the near post, and it's poked in. All the shot of pulled the goal back late. It's Giles Phillips with what I believe might be his first order shot town goal. It's scant consolation, Joe. Prior to that, of course, they conceded once in the first half. And we've put, pulled back a goal. I just think it's probably a little bit of uh, tardiness from the, from the uh, side that are leading. Well... Are you in with the shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video, click here to subscribe.